Hey, I'm Jay from the Cubs Guys. Welcome back to another episode of Reckon to the Scary Animations. I got a few good ones that we're gonna check out in today's episode of Yes, Cool That You Down With That. Everybody get ready and buckle up, cause here we go! For anybody wondering what happened to my old headphones, I broke them in a rage while I was recording the other day. Rest in peace to these bad boys, but uh, they'll be back soon. I'll get a new pair. First video of today's episode is called A Creepy Guy Breaks Into My House. Creepy people break into people's houses all the time. Let's see what makes it so special for this person. I am a 19 year old male. And this happened many years ago okay. when I was very young. To give you an idea of the layout of our house back then, the living room has multiple windows that directly look out onto the back garden. There's a big gate in our driveway to stop anyone from getting in. Why is this dude whispering so hard? Did somebody break into his house again and he's trying to record this without alerting the people that are robbing his house right now? So my mother was completing the household chores as she does one day. Look like I was sitting in the living room watching television on the sofa with my back to the living room windows. All of a sudden, I saw a figure reflecting off of the picture frame hanging on the wall opposite the window. I asked my mom if my dad was back from work, to which she said no. I'll never ever forget the look of horror on her face when I told her that yes he was, he's in the garden. She looked outside the window and almost had a heart attack when Ooh, she saw a scruffy looking, orange-haired Michael Jackson looking ass built man outside the Dude living room. looking like he'll window. say yee. This didn't seem to phase him at all, though. <laughs> Looking like a tee -hee. He psychotically smiled at my mother through the glass. Bro and my mom asked him on what he window. was doing on our property. He said nothing. Oh, with the same sadistic <laughs> smirk on his face. <laughs> she said that she was going to call the police. And what he said is one of the scariest things I've ever heard. Shut the fuck up! He screamed at my mother through the glass that if she even got her phone out, that he would break the glass. She did not know what to do. She wanted to protect me by calling the police, but she also didn't want him to hurt me if she did try to call them. As soon as he saw that she was terrified, he ran for the back door. What the heck? My mother told him to fuck off, which enraged him, and he pulled out a pocket knife and began bashing hard against the wow. windows. I was still oblivious to what was happening as I just thought it was my dad. I was very young. My mom frantically you young, grabbed you're not a me. Dumbass kid. And I don't mean picked me up. She literally grabbed me off the sofa and booked it up the stairs. We were backing up in the upstairs hallway looking for anywhere to hide <laughs> She's like, when my mom's younger brother popped out of his room with his headphones going? on. Wait, you telling me this whole time there was another person inside the house just chilling? It was a buff looking dude too? Like, is you serious, baby girl? My mom didn't even realize he was home and he clearly didn't hear the commotion downstairs because of his headphones. Dude looking like Gray Bart Simpson. Come on, man. My Hi, uncle Caramba. was 25 at the time and it was really well built. He's intimidated a lot of people. Okay, my mom perfect. This dude is the perfect candidate to scare that spooky looking Costco Michael Jackson looking dude. Cried and told him that there's a guy who's trying to break in. While dude she's got telling buns him and this, thighs, bro. that creepy lunatic screamed from downstairs that he was in the house. He said cynically, Boogeyman is coming out to get you. Boogeyman? Really? There's a dude that broke into the house named Boogeyman? Ain't nobody scared of Boogeyman. I should slap the hell out of that guy. His name's Boogeyman? Which really freaked me out. <laughs> it freaked me out so much that I actually remember that to this day. Bookie Man is anyway, on par with calling yourself Booger Boy or something. Home, he kept yelling. Nobody scared of this connect the dot eyebrows looking ass dude. And that it wouldn't be painful. As told by Ginger My looking ass. to lock ourselves in the bathroom and call the police. We did. And after five minutes of groaning and blatant violence downstairs, the police stormed in. Freeze, motherfuckers! And found the guy oh, God damn! Yo, <laughs> Face like Friday night meat, my guy. Roid rage. Mercilessly. My uncle really didn't. Relax, bro. Turns out that he was a known pedophile, which is why he okay, was watching I mean, he deserved me for that. so long while I was watching TV. After that day, my mom was terrified to be home. Her head is on a swivel, too. She's like, <laughs> I loved it as a child because I found the running and hiding fun. Obviously, because I was young. I can never thank my uncle enough for being there at the right time. When yeah, he my was whooping that face. clearly forgot that he was still home. It honestly gives me chills 
wondering what he would have done to my mother and myself. Like, this man really looked like a grown-up Chucky Finster that's been on too many adventures with Tommy. Next video of today's episode comes from the legendary Meat Canyon. It is called I Can Count to Three. So if you don't know how to count to three, here you go. <laughs> What the fuck? Learning can be scary. All right. But it can also be incredibly fun. God damn. When counting. Oh, that's hot. It's nice to almost think of it as a fun up, song to sing along to. She got ass. Soggy ass, but ass nonetheless. Got a head on her too. You know, just going. Let's begin with our first song now. Ew. Try to repeat after me. I would not put anything in that. I mean, she is a pig, so what the hell am I even One. talking about? Two. Oh, shit. That's a huge bitch! Three. Whoa, this one's actually creepy! Did you hear the way he said that? One. Two. Let's try that one. Three. One. That's actually really creepy. You're doing wonderfully. <laughs> Oh my god, what the hell? This is actually creeper than the other ones in the past. Two. Three. Okay, everybody, prepare your butt cheeks. You know Great coming. work. You can probably say, I can count to three. Oh god damn! <laughs> All oh, that is fucked up. One. All oh, that is capital F fucked. Two. Three. Why did those pig sounds sound so back. real? Last video of today's episode is called Other Lily. It comes from a channel called Let's Read. I will leave the link to the channel in the description box below. But let me shh and let's get into this. Make sure Beth goes to bed before 10. Shut up, dad. You don't tell me what to do. It's not like you're my dad or anything. You know what I just noticed too? It said the text was sent at 9.50 p.m. You mean to tell me dad only gives this girl 10 minutes to put Beth to bed before 10? What an asshole. Beth's probably dead already. Like, that's my gut feeling. My gut tells me a lot of things and my gut is usually right. I think Beth is clapped. Oh no, Beth's sleeping. Man, what a responsible young lady. Night, Beth. <laughs> what if that was a real rat and that heart was made out of Beth's blood? Lily, me, other Lily. Hell no. If I saw that, if I had like a younger sister or a younger brother and they drew J, me, other J, I'd wake them up and be like, what is this? Who is other J, huh? I'm sorry, I wouldn't do that. I like how she has a baseball bat too. I like Lily. I hope she whoops other Lily's ass once we see her. What is that? Uh oh. I hate waking up at three in the morning. Wait, what? Who? Who's that? Other Beth? You go to sleep. In the world, you little shit? Oh, God! What the? Oh, God! Ugh. animation style is so freaking good. Oh! I should have seen it. I should have seen it coming. <laughs> Holy crap. Yeah, get the bat. Get the strap. Get the bat, then the strap. What? Oh! Sir! 
about to go major league with these home runs on that head. Who wants to get clocked? Who wants the 3 a.m. clocking? I would not go downstairs. I would go to Beth's room first. Make sure she's all right. Whoa, I saw somebody in the window. I don't know. I feel like people are so dumb these days. Like, they just do things out of character. Oh, shit. I mean, there's not much you could do about that. Somebody already broke in. Oh, my God! Holy crap! Oh, shit! No, you just killed a kid! Lily, you just killed a kid! Oh. No, you didn't! No, oh, you just smacked the demon! A dream within a dream? Really? Wait, is that Beth now? Or Lily younger version? Wait, where's your bat? Oh, that is Beth. Where's Lily? Damn, she had no problem just slugging her sister across the skull. I like that. That's gangster. Like, remind me never to mess with Lily. Okay, so the window's good. So that was just a dream. Oh my god! What the heck, man? What is happening in this video? Is other Lily gonna wake up now? Is the dad gonna wake up? Oh, wow. That's how it ends. Yo, I rarely see videos where they killed the kid. So let me clap that up. They killed the kid. All right, everybody, but that's going to do it for this episode of Reacting to These Scary Animations. Hopefully, you all enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude.